Here's a quick Google Classroom tip. And I got this one from the wonderful Sean Fahey. And one thing that you can do is make use of private comments between you and students. So I'm logged in as a student right now in Google Classroom. And you'll see I am on the assignment page. And in the right-hand column, there is an option to add a private comment. That's a private conversation between the teacher and student. Even if you allow class comments, this is not something that other students can have. So this is the perfect place for feedback and things like that. But Sean's suggestion is to have students submit a reflection as a private comment when they turn in their work. So the student could type their reflection right here. And of course, we would want to give them really specific directions or a quick prompt on how to do that, like what did you like most about the assignment? What part challenged you the most? And you want to make sure that you also add that to the directions so that students understand what this assignment is. So once the student has completed their reflection assignment, they just send that and post it as a private comment. So as the teacher to view those private comments, it gets a little confusing. So you can go to your class, click on your classwork tab, go into the assignment, click view assignment, and then you'll see next to the student's name, if they have left a comment, it'll give you a little preview down here. So I can see that student one has posted their reflection here as a private comment. And I can also comment to leave feedback. If you're watching this video on YouTube and you like these tips, be sure that you ring the bell so that you get notified when I post new tips each week.